Prince Charles and his wife Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall spent a personal anniversary apart after the Prince of Wales tested positive for coronavirus. On Thursday, Clarence House revealed that Prince Charles, 73, had received a positive COVID-19 test. The prince was due to make an appearance at a number of engagements in Winchester which were postponed as the royal undertakes a period of self-isolation. Charles was said to be deeply disappointed to miss out on the highly anticipated visit but Clarence House noted that his appearance in Winchester will be rescheduled. The tweet reads, This morning, February 10, the Prince of Wales has tested positive for COVID-19 and is now self-isolating. HRH is deeply disappointed not to be able to attend today's events in Winchester and will look to reschedule his visit as soon as possible. Despite Prince Charles testing positive on Thursday morning, Camilla has tested negative, Clarence House confirmed. The news of Charles' positive Covid test fell on the anniversary of the announcement of his engagement to Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall 17 years ago. After many years together, the news Camilla and Charles were to marry was finally revealed to the public on February 10, 2005. A statement from the Queen was released at the time which read, The Duke of Edinburgh and I are very happy that the Prince of Wales and Mrs Parker Bowles are to marry. We have given them our warmest good wishes for their future together. The couple got married in April that year, 35 years after meeting. Charles is currently self-isolating and is likely to do this away from his wife in order to prevent her from catching the virus. This likely means the royals are set for heartbreak as any plans the couple may have had to mark their engagement anniversary on the day, or over the coming weekend is also likely cancelled now. This is because England's Covid rules state if you've tested positive for coronavirus, Covid-19, you usually have to self-isolate for 10 full days. However, it adds that the isolation period can be reduced if two Covid tests in a row come back negative after day 5 of the self-isolation period. Also, in England, contacts of positive Covid cases who are fully vaccinated should take lateral flow tests for 7 days to check if they have contracted the virus. So while Camilla does not have to self-isolate unless she tests positives, she will be undertaking daily tests. In addition, this is not the first time that Charles has tested positive for COVID-19. The heir to the throne first tested positive in March 2020 when the virus first gripped the UK. After recovering, the prince reported only mild symptoms. Clarence House has confirmed Charles is now triple vaccinated, but would not give any detail on whether he was experiencing coronavirus symptoms this time around. A palace source has since claimed Prince Charles had been in contact recently with the Queen, 95, just days before receiving a positive test result. The Queen met with her son on Tuesday, they added. On Thursday, Buckingham Palace declined to say whether she had been tested for the virus after being made aware of the prince's illness, citing her privacy.